is up you guys welcome back to my channel my name is maria if this is the first time you're tuning in welcome today i wanted to share with you all products that i found at dollar tree that you can absolutely not miss if you find these items make sure to grab them because they're flying off the shelves let's dive right in so the first item that i wanted to show y'all were these beads these are just beads on a string i recently posted a tiktok on these and they went absolute viral these are a must-have for sure from dollar tree you can do a lot of diy crafts with these and these are great for every season not just this fall but they did come out with a fall collection here's the little tag these are beautiful they're just on a string they don't have the measurement but i would say it's pretty lengthy it's just on one string and these beads are made out of wood they're very very sturdy i've banged them up and they haven't broken so if you find these you absolutely need to grab these asap because these are flying off the shelves and i'm just gonna fly through these items because i really want y'all to know what are the top favorites i'm gonna be doing another fall video with more extensive items so that way y'all can see like everything that i got this is just a fraction of the fall items that i got at my biggest location they actually came out with the fall and the halloween items at the same time i don't know if they're gonna come out with more items i saw online that they do have more items than what they have in store so it's just one of those things that we have to figure it out as we go along so one of the other hot commodities were these christmas trees but they are halloween style i believe they had this one and a gold one i might be wrong on the gold one i have a picture of it so inserting it here i got the black and orange one and i got some ornaments as well it's pretty much the length of the box it just sprouts out if you've had the easter or the christmas trees they are the same length i'm going to categorize this as its own thing the christmas tree items because there's just so many little components to it along with the christmas tree i got the matching ornaments they had these cute black ones little imprints on the side some are glittery but these are small size i thought these were just the cutest thing and then i ended up getting these bigger spheres they come in a count of five. Oh, by the way these are an account of 16 these smaller black ones and then these ones right here are glitter orange spider webs with some black glitter on the other every other ball these are a five count for a dollar i thought these were phenomenal to go on the little christmas tree i might have overdone it with the ornaments i think i got too many but it's better to be safe than sorry and then next up i got these purple ones with some eyeballs right here i thought these were so cute one of the eyeballs is green whereas the other one is orange and then purple spheres glitter glitter everywhere and then i got these orange ones every other one is glitter and then the other ones have glitter black bats there we go there we go that was kind of a tw tongue twister orange ones they're so adorable hopefully i'm not blinding y'all and i got these black and white ones with the eyeballs again and one of the eyeballs is purple and the other one is this beautiful blue let's see if i can you can't really see it but these are also very glittery so we shall see how much glitter is on my carpet after this and then to go along with the tree i got this led strip this is actually one of those wires i know they have two different types of lights at dollar tree they have this one that's just in the wire form and then they have this one which is the like you can kind of see in the packaging but i got one in orange and i got one in purple i thought this would just complement each other the purple ones are a little bit more bigger than the orange ones, so it should complement each other on the tree and these are battery operated next couple items y'alls absolutely need to get your hands on are the pumpkins they came out this year with velvet and glitter pumpkins I'm, I'm not sure if they did that last year or not but this year i can tell these are gonna fly off the shelves they already have at most of my dollar trees but there's still a select few that have a ton of these and i'm so excited to show y'all how i'm gonna decorate these so they came out with so many colors i think i grabbed one of each but my overall favorites had to be this purple burgundy shade and then this pink one right here as well look at these they're so gorgeous and if you have a dollar tree plus they actually had the bigger versions i didn't see this purple burgundy as a bigger option but all the other ones for the most part did have a bigger count counterpart so make sure you grab one i also love this terracotta color it's so beautiful look at this this just screams fall and these are like a faux velvet type material surrounding the pumpkin i would just say be cautious when you buy your pumpkins because sometimes you can see the seams in the middle i don't know if you can kind of see it on this pink one but it's a little bit visible in person not too bad though and then going along with the pumpkins they also came out with these plaid ones they had it in orange blue and this black i absolutely love these little pumpkins they're just so adorable other pumpkins you absolutely need are these ceramic ones they come in orange and white they are absolutely absolutely beautiful and they are actually space savers because they open up what so you can put these like at the entrance of your room at the entrance of your house you could store your keys in here there's so many great options for these and for only a dollar you cannot pass this up they do not break easily in my opinion i've been banging them accidentally in this little basket that i have and they are holding up very very well these are a definite must-have let me put it on 
Oh, oh. Along with those pumpkins, I also found these little guys. These are so adorable. So this is a three-tier type pumpkin. It says, be blessed, be thankful. These are absolutely gorgeous, and you can put them up for Halloween, fall, um, Thanksgiving, you name it. So they had the orange, the white, and the blue. Ironically, the white ones are packaged in a way that makes the stem fall off. It is broken in the package. Like, I actually opened up the box, and I saw the stem there at the bottom. But it was just the way it was packaged, because it was packaged like this, whereas the other ones were packaged like that. The white ones most likely at your location will also break just FYI so you'll have to do your own stem but these are gorgeous for the price like also a great thing to put at your little space that you might have and these are actually these actually carry nice weight so if you have documents or something that you need to hold down on your desk these are a great little two-in-one going along with the pumpkin theme these little items right here are flying off the shelves I'm gonna show you individually what they are but they are pumpkins some of the most exciting finds were these little mini pumpkins they come in both a black plaid and orange plaid just like the big versions but these are the small versions these are great if you're gonna make wreaths or centerpieces or any of that these are the way to go these are gorgeous they have a little stem and everything these are definitely flying off the shelves and if you find them you need to grab them they also had glittery pumpkins these are gorgeous as well in purple and orange they also had the sugar schools they were in gray and white glitter but I passed those up these are also great for wreaths and just decorating general spaces I love these you can do so much with them you can do snow globes but like fall edition decorate centerpieces as well there's so many options for these so pick them up and there's a lot in these there are 12 pieces per pack so definitely worth it going along with those pumpkin themes they also had these faux velvet mini pumpkins same deal as the bigger pumpkins but in small version i love this whole concept of them shrinking items next items were these cute little pillows they had four or five variations of this but i definitely picked up this one that says happy harvest and has three pumpkins on it and then i picked up this plaid one that says give thanks i thought this would be so cute to put around the areas where my dogs like to lay up here so I have a little nook for them and I just thought these would be perfect to spruce up during the fall season so these are going to be really really handy but you can also use them for other stuff of course they are cotton filled so they're really really soft to the touch and I just think they're so gorgeous and the back is just plain like this definitely fall vibes. Next items you need to pick up are these letters. So these are going like hot tamales. I got an M and I got an A. I actually got more, but these are just the two sizes that I saw that were available. They had this little piece right up here. So as you can see, they have an orange one and then they have a white one. This one's shorter than this one. You need to be careful when you're choosing these or just need to be prepared to buff them down because the bottom here, there's like two pieces. One piece is glued on top of the other. So you kind of need to shave it down if it's a little bit past the this part if not it's not going to stand up i hope that made sense but these are definitely a must have you can always paint over it if you can't find your initial and just you know write your initial dolly tree has stencils so these are just a great way to spruce up any space that you have for this fall Next items you need to look out for are these huge flowers. These are beautiful. I actually saw them and I was like, you know what? These would be beautiful for Halloween pictures or fall pictures. These can go in your hair. No one needs to know. They have a clasp on the back so you can really do anything and like stick them anywhere really. I was planning on doing like some hair photo shoots in the fall, like out in the forest or something. Also wreaths. These are really, really great for wreaths or just any decoration that you have in mind. They have so many variations. I got like all the colors, but these were my top two favorites. This little burgundy with glitter and then this one that's more of a neutral sunflower shade with the glittery middle these are just absolutely stunning and with that they have so many little flower bouquets that you need both for fall and for halloween so for halloween i picked up these they also have the ones with spiders but i personally do not like spiders so i like quickly passed that but these are so adorable they have a glittery purple pumpkin this stuff right here i forget what it's called and then black roses with the little stem i thought these are just so adorable i got two of them so for a dollar each great little centerpieces i only need two because it's pretty it's pretty thick she thick they also have the light up roses i passed because i thought they were a little tacky but it's a cute idea and for fall they actually had these little cute ones they have flowers and stuff like that don't get me wrong but i thought these were just adorable for like little table center pieces i got two of these um they have a little pine cone the pumpkin and again these little things that look like peas um so that's what these look like and then some more decor here are these pumpkins and these leaves that come in plaid shades i only saw these in one of my dollar trees i was pretty surprised to be honest that I found these because they're made out of wood they're plaid and they're 
just great for DIY. So I'm excited to use these. These are also a great alternative. If you don't find the wood pieces with your initials, you can always pick up these and write your name on them. That's one idea. So if you like Halloween, you most likely like Hocus Pocus the movie. And I heard they're coming out with the second one this year. Hopefully, fingers crossed, fingers crossed. But I saw these at Dollar Tree and I screamed because these remind me so much of Hocus Pocus. So I picked up all three and they have the little boots at the end. I've seen people put these at the ends of their cars. So like the feet hang out. I'm not gonna do that but I'm gonna do a hocus pocus theme this year in my house so I'm gonna incorporate these in some way and I'm so excited to show y'all how I do it but I thought these were just so adorable and for hocus pocus themed anything that's a definite must-have they also had stickers that said hocus pocus on it that's gonna be one of the items that I show you in my fall video so make sure to subscribe next items I want to show y'all are these laser print cutouts they had multiple styles I didn't pick up all of them but I picked up these so first off I had this female Katrina these are wooden plaques technically the wood is really really thin so you have to be careful to make sure you're not gonna break it I love anything female Katrina like Day of the Dead inspired like that's my jam so I was so excited to find her I actually picked up two and I'm gonna be putting them together like facing towards each other I actually got male version as well I don't really like the male version but I was like you know what might as well might as well I'm here they also had this Halloween house shaped one I thought this was so gorgeous what and look at the detailing like the detailing is what really got me it looks like something very expensive something that you would definitely find over ten dollars at Michael's or another store I also found this colander one reminded me again of Hocus Pocus it says trick-or-treat absolutely beautiful ah look at this oh I think this is how it's gonna show up right yeah something like that this was a must-have and the last one kind of in this theme is just a basic happy Halloween but again the detailing really makes up for it it has a bat the spiders which kind of freaked me out overall I love the shape and I just love the simplicity and then the last laser cutout were these little guys so this is just a basic like mason faux jar type looking thing with an initial in the middle they had a ton of these I picked up of course what my initial M. I love how it has a plaid design right here and then my initial and then this detailing it would have been cool if they lasered this as well but either way it's absolutely gorgeous and you can always put something else here so the m is more reflective this top piece is actual like i don't know if it's real metal or if it's aluminum but it's one of those pieces so gorgeous so the next item i want to show you are these led candle pillar lights there we go they came out with two designs they came out with this one that's kind of like a cushion type faux design with some faux pearls right here i thought this was adorable and then they have these ones that don't really have anything but they have that curvature on the side so it gives it some character like if you want to do like a candelabra type thing these would be really nice just putting that out there but they're both gorgeous and they do offer like pretty good light i have my lights on right now so it's not the best to show y'alls but it does have the little led right there in the middle and always make sure that they work before you get them because sometimes they do not turn on i took off the little sticker on the bottom before i purchased them and tested it out but these are so adorable and I'm just realizing they're kind of scratched, like, because it's kind of some kind of waxy texture to it. These are still a great deal, so if you see them, pick them up. Next thing are the ribbons. They had so many ribbons. Like, literally at one of my locations, they only had a box and they all flew. These were some of my favorites. I also have a squirrel one somewhere. I'm telling you, I need to do an extensive video of all the fall items that I got because there's so many. These were just some of my favorites. So I got this skinnier one that's orange in the middle and then it has gold outline. And then I picked up these two, so the bottom one is a green green and then this one up here is a plaid they are both gorgeous and they both have wire on the side so these are really great for wreaths couple more items and i'm done for today okay so these are the next top items that i found these just go in your yard they're aluminum i believe and they're spray painted so i got one in burgundy and i got one in orange they also had a white one but the white one in my opinion looked kind of crusty sorry if i offended anybody i believe they don't rust I've had other Dollar Tree stuff out in the rain and it doesn't rust, so I think these should be good. They're pretty decently sized, like you can see they're like big. They're big, so these are great, great, great. Okay, last but not least, I'm going to show you all some of the signs that I thought were the best. So they came out with a couple of these that are two for one. So let me show you all this one first. This one says, welcome to our haunted house right here. And then this one over here says the witch is in. I just think these are so adorable for doorknobs or even on wall decor. You just really got to play around with them. Or even if you want to take the little wire off, there's so many possibilities. So this is just one option. Next option was this one with the witch and the skull on it. The skull says happy Halloween. And 
the witch one says the witch is in. I thought these are so adorable. You could also probably hang them up like on your car or something like in the back. I'm getting glitter everywhere. And then the next design that they came out with was this pumpkin one and the cat one. So the pumpkin one says trick or treat. And the cat one says beware black cat crossing. So these are just adorable and you get two for one, which is a great deal. And even if you don't like the design on the front, you can always, always, always turn it around or strip the front, whichever one you want and do your own design on the back. And then I'm just gonna show you these items really quick. These are all signs and oh my gosh, I just love the signs this year. They're so plentiful. So first off, I got this mason jar right here and it says in the middle, always be thankful. I just thought this was so adorable. I'm probably gonna do over this little area, just leave this little part up here. I thought the shape was cute for and it has a lot of potential. Next up I got this little sign it says pumpkin is the spice of life so I'm probably gonna keep the front but I'm gonna do something on the back as well make it dual ended so when I get tired of this sign um, I could just flip it over and see the other side but we will see what I've come up with and then I was super excited to find this year this chalkboard I actually got two pieces and they have this pumpkin carving in the middle I thought this was just so adorable it's just it's just cute like why wouldn't you you know like you can write how many days till halloween which is probably what i'm gonna do there's just so much potential and they are both chalkboard on the back so you can flip it around or i don't know there's just so much potential for them of course they had the long boards these are really great for diys i'm actually going to use a couple and do like a whole canvas so stay tuned for that they did have one with a truck this sunflower one this welcome one the truck had a plaid the truck had a plaid design but these are the two that i picked up and i'm probably going to keep this one as is is, but I'm probably gonna paint this one over and they have so much glitter y'all is like be prepared for the glitter and then last but not least in the signs actually I, I got more signs this is one of my all-time favorite ones that I wanted to get I got two just in case I want to layer it to make a bigger sign there's a lot of potential here as well I might just flip it over I don't know I don't know it looks like this yeah it's so cute it's so cute like why not it says fall like come on now but yeah you guys that was my little haul hopefully you enjoyed it it was pretty quick i hope i hope like i said i'm gonna do another full length youtube video going over all the fall items that i got because i got so much like it's incredible there was so many great finds my top tip is that if you find it get it right then and there because fall and halloween items are just flying off the shelves right and left and they're gonna come out with more items because hello we're still in august like barely in august so there's gonna be a lot more stuff just keep your eye out for it and if you want to know the latest of course follow me as always and if you haven't already go follow me on tiktok because that's where i upload more persistently i almost forgot to mention that this little ribbon right here is the plaid one this flew off the shelves like no other if you find this design definitely pick it up because find this you're lucky pick it up this is one of those items that a lot of people seek because it's universal you can use it now you can use it in winter time when christmas comes around you can use it for the summer so it's one of those ribbons that's super popular it is wired it is nine feet so really really great value so that was my little haul thank you so much if you made it so far if you haven't already please make sure to subscribe like and leave me a comment make sure to follow me on tiktok and like i said i'm gonna be doing a full length fall video that's gonna be more inclusive to other items that i got but a little bit faster paced because sometimes i tend to over explain some items but that video is gonna be like boom 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 so stay tuned for that and i will see you guys in my next video